Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're a newcomer, this is Bukumi Robert. I'm Bukumi Robert. And my YouTube channel is about hairstyle, lifestyle, and everything style. And if you're a subscriber, I love you so much. Thank you. Anyhow, today I'm going to be talking about um, split ends, hair breakage, and when to trim your hair. And actually how to trim your hair too. So before I get into that, please, if you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Thank you very much. Now that you've done that, let us begin. And my first trim happened when last year, October, and it happened because my hair was breaking a lot. In 2018, that's the picture there. I, I that's when I initially started my hair journey, and I had the ends like badass. No, what is the what's the end? Yes, like very unequal, shapeless hair, and. I, my, my sister and my friends are trying to me, to me trim your hair and I was like, no, I'm not trimming my hair all because I watched the video on YouTube and the girl said that you don't need to trim your hair um, to grow your hair and I listened, I actually listened to her and I paid the price because even after that period, I continued taking my care of my hair my hair kept on growing but last year, my hair just dr drastically started breaking like it was bad my ends were rubbish, they were dry, they were freezy they were wrong, so I had to cut my hair. My hair I had my first trim last year, October, and I was so scared. My hair was somewhere around here. I cut it through here. And now I've gained some length. Actually gained some length back. Here is it. I mean it's trim my hair, it's nice. Okay, my hair is actually quite equal, but my hair is actually screaming for a trim right now. My hair is screaming for a trim right now. So I'm going to tell you certain things you will notice about your hair that tells you that you actually need to trim your hair. You actually need to trim your hair. And don't mind for that my hair looks quite shapeless because I cannot comb it out. I'm actually finding it really hard to comb my hair out now. And that's where my number one comes in. You have annoying knots at the end of your hair. You know, because uh it's very four hair type is very, very coily, very coily. So it can e e easily tangle but your hair needs a trim when you start having knots at the end of your hair i have so many knots at the end of my hair like they are so bad i wish i could fish one out for you guys right now but that's why i haven't combed my hair like i i just really hate combing my hair right now so when i trim my hair it'll be a lot better and two when you have split ends the ends can actually be confusing because when i first heard of split, split ends i didn't really understand but i'll just explain to you guys in my own term now if you want to know your split ends your hair you can't do your hair in a perfect afro like this my hair still even has more shape than how split ends make your hair look like split ends will make this your ends transparent to see if you get what i mean the, the picture i showed in 2018 yeah that's how your hair will be looking like then your curls you, your curls or your coils won't form at all it'll just be looking dead and strange and wrong that's it strange and wrong then three hair breakage when your hair starts breaking you need to trim your hair you need a trim you don't need to cut it like three inches or five inches away but your hair will need a trim if your hair is breaking okay. oh you know your hair needs a trim when your ends are frizzy when they start thinning sorry when they start thinning very 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 easy and dry and dry there's one trick that you should do um, you know first it type hair normally feels dry so 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 don't even i have one trick for you to do when you're applying a living conditioner um fill your hair from the roots to the ends now if your hair your ends feel very very dry i mean they don't feel as smooth as the hair strands on your roots that means girl you need a trim you now that is done and said and done okay i'm going to show you guys how to trim your hair and what we are going to be using we're going to need white tooth comb okay and the scissors this kind of scissors please do not go using this kind of scissors or kitchen scissors or craft scissors not good for your hair okay this kind of scissors let me call it baba scissors or i can't remember what it is no I just brush my hair too. Then comb it through. First you see. 
tangy and you like to combine the small thing. This small thing will speak, let you know exactly where you want to see this kind of hat. But yes, now look at my hair. Sorry, I'm trying to look at my hair in the mirror. See exactly where I want to trim. And my hair doesn't need much trimming. Just this side. This is always never side do. You just see how I did it? Black right hair. So where every leg was equal. This is the ring side that it's not equal with the ring. So oh, it is off. Oh, voila. Everything is not straight enough, you can do some justice to it. But yes. I've got my hair. <laughs> but my hair. I didn't cut it just trim it But yeah. I did it. I did it guys. I did it. <laughs> now let's just continue. Trimming your hair takes time and patience, so please don't rush while you're trying to trim your hair, okay? Do not rush while you're trying to trim your hair. And check section your hair, please. Ah, so guys, I'm done. I did it. I trimmed my whole hair. Trimmed my entire hair. Cannot believe this, guys. If I go through it now, there will be no irritating, annoying knots. See? My hand is just sliding through. It's just sliding through. Ah, oh my god. It wasn't stressful, actually. It wasn't stressful. Just tired. And you can do it too. Whether your hair is short or not, you have to trim your hair. If your hair is shorter than mine, trim it. If you feel your hair needs trimming, trim it. Just don't cut it unnecessarily. And if you are not sure of yourself, just take yourself to the hairstylist. But I've noticed one thing hairstylists are so joyful when they have to trim your hair. They don't, they literally don't even trim it, they like cut it. So, So, you should actually trim your hair by yourself, okay? You're the one that knows what's best for your hair, so I'm going to trim it. But yeah, now I have to go and wash my hair because they have hair wash day. Yeah, mm -mm, mm -mm. I've got this stress. Stress of taking care of your hair. Now, yeah, thank you for watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't, okay? Come back next time for more interesting stuff on hair and life and everything. Bye!